All right, so in theory, this should be like a three minute video. So that's what I got on my phone because I got to delete some videos. So try to keep this short and simple, maybe less talking. So I got this John Deere 108 that you guys know. Um, last summer I tore it all apart and well, I dug it back out, cleaned off the frame, so you know how clean it was. And you know, got thinking, had a dream, you know, turning this John Deere into, you know, the third racing mower. The third racing mower would be the nice one. So this is going to be the nice one. So I got thinking. I can keep it just like the MTD. Keep it bare bones. Don't lower it. Just make it fast and, you know, keep it like that. So that turned a switch in my head and said, you know what? Let's do it. So I had to think of an engine because, you know, it had this little eight horse Briggs and Stratton flathead i didn't want to really you know destroy that engine because it's it's a good running engine i still have everything over there for it so i got to thinking these holes are made for v twins and opposed twins so i got thinking even more come over here i can either put the opposed twin in that tractor and it'd already be pulley swapped, but I'd have to run into some issues of, you know, the pulleys, the the idlers and tensioners. But I can always move those. But I was thinking, I got a V-twin, V-twin Vanguard. So I'll let you guys know down in the comments, or you guys let me know. But I'm thinking more of the V-twin, just because of it's already got the one pipe. So that has the true duels. I don't have anything that runs into the one. So I'm thinking about putting this one in. So I'm going to have to try to get that pulley off and drop it down in there and uh, see how she fits. So I want to dig out the V-twin first. But if you guys want me to run the, the opposed twin, let me know down in the comments. So then all I have to do is just put it back together, get another carburetor for it, and, you know, then we just have to modify the uh the clutch pulleys because you already know we're gonna have major clearance issues i don't even know what that is that's some sort of oh this is that's nifty i'm gonna just have to slide that back so that might be pretty easy <coughs> but you guys let me know down in the comments so this is just gonna be a short little video of the third and final racing mower i mean there's probably gonna be a fourth one but this is going to be the one that's going to stay in the shed just like the MTD. So it's going to have a little bit more time, you know, of me building it just like this one. And it's going to be clear coated just like this one. And it's going to be well taken care of just like this one. Not like the craftsman that's sitting outside right now. So, yeah. So, new racing mower. It's got the five speed in it. Don't know how long that's going to last. So, don't question me on it. So it might have a six-speed swap here pretty soon, but I'm I'm hoping this one stays together. So it's just gonna have a rear pulley, two and a half inch rear pulley on it, with the stock pulley on it. If we do the post twin, it's gonna be governor delete with the four inch on it, and it's gonna do about 40. So it's gonna be a little bit faster than this one. So you guys, let me know down in the comments, and and yeah, I'll I don't know why my phone just shut off. So oh yeah, had a phone call delete so yeah you guys just let me know and uh we might go with the opposed twin but i'd rather have the vanguard and we can put you know more gauges and it's got oil pressure so maybe there's a way that we can bypass the governor on this one so we'll have to look into that because it's it's got more of an open look to it not like this one where it's covered up with plastic with the carburetor so yeah let me know down in the comments. I'll be live this Saturday putting this thing back together. You know, the, the metal and the dash and the hood. And by then, I'll already have an engine picked out from you guys or from me. So, yeah, stay tuned for the Saturday, and I will see you guys all later.